Welcome back to some Life is Strange. Let's... Now that we're back in reality, we should check... That's Rachel and Frank. That's Kate Marsh so killing close, herself. Yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. Two, get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Three, beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. Too bad I don't have a gun anymore. Yes, that's the solution. We'll have to do this on our own. Dude, at least let me kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. You should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna yep. cyberstalk some names and see where that leads. Or to who. And be careful of Stepcrack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and Mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. I'm on it. I can't abuse this level of my rewind power. Yeah, we're not going to do that again. I mean, it was fun to see uh, what, what would have been, but, you know. Never again. <sighs> That's David. I'm actually kind of glad to see you, David. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. That's kind of sad. What's that? Looks like David already booked a room. That's kind of sad though. Warren. Yo, yeah, Max, your friend, Chloe, your friend Chloe told me that I'm out of the loop now. She sounds, she sounds hot, so I get why. Chloe actually texted you? I'm sure I didn't have her number. At least I still get to go ape with you, unless you want to chill with Chloe. Or we could all go. One pain in the ass is enough. Cool. <laughs> And no messages from Victoria. Mom. Yes, I even killed my plant. I even killed my plant, Lisa. Oh, sorry, sweetie. Get another. One plant was stressful enough. Now back to the books. Courtney. Hey, girlfriend. Let me know you want to, want to come over by my room and give you a fashion makeover. Oh, thanks, Courtney. Richard March. Oh, Max, this is Richard March again. I want to let you know that Kate's services next week and our family would like to extend an invitation to you. Thank you, Richard March. I absolutely will attend to the service. Service, good. Juliet, um. Okay, but you can't keep secrets from Ace reporter Julian Watson. Hello? Don't see some people, come on. Drugs, that's it? Do you know Frank Bowers? Drugs, that's it? Ask Nathan, he knows him, I think. Okay, I'm on it. Thanks, Justin. For what? <laughs> Dad. Hi, honey. I just got a weird text warning me that your... That my nosy daughter better stop watching others and look out for herself. Is this some kind of school prank? And it's from Pluck the Number. Oh, I'm so sorry. Some jackass in my class thought that would be funny to send. It's not. I don't like stranger having my number, okay? Me neither. Sorry. I'm just being a dad. I know this has been 
a tough week for you. And Chloe. And there was no emoji. So weird. Alrighty. We gotta check every single fucking corner. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Oh, Jesus. Um... Email. Should I have signed the petition? Blackwell sure isn't safe and private anymore. Despite our rather heated discussion about the successful petition to block our campus services, I'm still interested in your feedback on other methods of improving back Blackwell's security. We must find a federal ground between safety and privacy for our students. Best, Principal Wells. Oh, meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. I didn't need a surveillance camera to see this suspension coming. Best of luck to you. Oh. At least he has one weird fan. Anonymous. I just wanted to let you know it's bullshit what happened to you, and this girl has too many leper metrosexuals who don't appreciate you or the military. I felt safe in my dorm when you were in charge, and I thought about you protecting me. I hope you will come back to Blackwell and make sure we are all safe at night. I am scared of this school. Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. From David Madsen to Raymond Wells. I apologize for my outburst yesterday in your office. Damn. Map. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts, too. Probably. Okay, 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 okay. Nothing in here. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could, too. Maybe we could somehow make two realities meet. I don't know. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? Thank you with your help with Nathan. It is appreciated. Best Sam Prescott. Gun. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. Yeah, I don't think she stole a gun. What's that? I wonder if David is going to the party. Oh, end of the world. That's ironic. Oh, he still kept all the food in here. Good. If the apocalypse actually starts. Oh, what's that? Oh, look at the baby blue jay eggs in the nest. I, I better move this plank if I want. Excuse me. Just one picture, please. <laughs> you really are a dork. Seriously, moving a plank made a difference. Another photo from my Arcadia Bay wildlife series. Let's move the plank back there. Move. Oh, thank you. Sleep tight, my eggy eggs. <laughs> That's adorable. I want to see the picture, actually. I want to see the pictures I've taken. Wednesday. All the people I know. Episodes. Okay. Um. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that walker. Hey, David, what you hiding? Oh fuck! I wish I remembered the code. Um. Um Doesn't work. For Fuck. once I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, I need to find a way to break this padlock. Fuck. No map. Okay, I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. 
Yep. Then we can just rewind, and it's like we never got there. Sorry, David, but I bet you would do the same thing as me. What's in here? Oh, maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. She knows something. Coordinates. That's Nathan Warren and me. That's the car pumper. And a picture of me. That's awesome, man. Score. What about the Back other lockers? Wait. I'm not gonna leave evidence. There you go. I need to... There's all the people we know. Episodes. Where can we see all that? Pictures. It looks so weird to see. It's amazing how much drama this living room has seen. I know, right? No, 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 no. I didn't mean to press that. Yo, Chloe! Are you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan and Rachel, plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. <laughs> now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Now let's go find out what Nathan is hiding in his room. We have to be extra careful. We can Next. just rewind now if he comes in. Now it's time for Nathan Prescott to be afraid of us. We're taking over Arcadia Bay, aren't we? Exactly what you wanted. Jefferson and Principal Wells. Oh, at least Samuel doesn't need to be alone. <laughs> hey, Max. How are you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? <laughs> Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for the school. It's a long story. And actual files here. <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Even though I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend. And I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. Dude. <laughs> Nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Dude, Chloe. Hot for teacher. Gross! You are out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am <laughs> so ignoring you. Fine. Since could here, could I have entered a photo? Justin. I kind of wanted to. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. 
I want to enter a photo, so what? Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. I think I can go there. My sweet Kate. Clear away another batch of dead birds today. Sad. Makes me mad. I'm not gonna interrupt you too. I think everything That's so is ironic that Warren asked Max to the drive-in. How come? Hey Brooke, how are you? Considering what happened to Kate, I could be better. Are you okay? Whales. I can't get my limited brain around that eclipse and the beached whales. I was hoping the science department had some ideas. Warren and I are supposed to compare notes and theories this weekend. He asked oh, you? he asked you? You know, science geeks stick together. But honestly, neither of us can explain this phenomenon. It's pretty scary. I'm gonna leave. I have to go. Talk later, Brooke. Don't hate me because you're. because I stole your man, you know? Yeah, no. Bigfoot, stop. Okay, damn. I don't think. Oh, wait. Uh, I wish I had Mr. Jefferson's talent. Hey, Daniel. You look bummed out. Are you all right? Hola, Max. Hola. I just figured out that my photos basically suck. I'm a wannabe artist. I love your drawings. You're not here to be a photographer. That's my gig. Look at that sketch you did of me. Incredible. And that's your art. Your gift. <sighs> I do feel better now. You are good, Max. By the way, have you seen Nathan Prescott? Oh, I heard a rumor he's actually suspended. Yeah, he is. he's still gotta be on campus. That explains why he looked so pissed off when I saw him leaving campus a few moments ago. Let's talk later. Okay, Daniel? We got a clue. Nathan is not around. I should go back to Chloe. Let's go back to Chloe. coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ugh, oh, <laughs> suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. He is pretty attractive, I gotta tell you that. Now Chloe understands why, why I'm here for a teacher. It's so lame, they don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Boys dorm, huh? I thought he was no girls allowed. The Vortex Club sucks ass. Toilet paper. Sit on shit. <laughs> Even after Kate, nobody here learned anything about bullying. Can I has art? Can you stop? Bigfoot's got big balls, but a small dick. Ugh, skunk weed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. Is it Hayden girl's name? The Prescott's rules this town. Shit. Poster. Poor Warren. This is the work of Nathan. He's so lucky I'm a pacifist. 
Hello, Warren's room. Hawking and him make a good team. Can I take off this poster? Nope. Damn it. Looks like one of the jocks did care about Kane. Sorry, Kate. Which one of these is Nathan's room? Nope. Even after Kate, yeah, nobody here learned anything about bullying. Oh, jerks. At least nobody messed with the Kate portrait. Cry, hipster, cry. What the fuck, dude? Max, hurry up and find Nathan's room. I'm trying. He should be next to the bathroom. Okay, not, not, Warren's, Jones. This can only be Nathan's room. Yeah, I kind of figured, because the Prisca thing. Yeah, thank you. Locked, isn't it? Got the fry that shit open. <laughs> Whoa. Camera. Now I need to find Nate. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. <laughs> Bastard. <laughs> Choice. Max, now that David is not here, I need Chloe to step up and stop acting out so much. But that won't happen if you and her are getting mixed up in. A little crap is breaking into Blackwell at night. I'm oh, sorry, Joyce. Even if I get into Shannon again, I am trying to be a good influence on Chloe. I know, Max. Uh, ooh. That's so amazing, though. Yes, I would be cool with having this high tech projector. Mm -hmm. Photos. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. Black and white photos. MP3 player turn on. Whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. At least he tries. Oh, there's nudes. Poster. Texture open. That is so Chloe. Hey asshole, we need to talk. I'm gonna tell everybody what you did, and you're going to pay, motherfucker. Oh my god. Chloe. What the fuck? <gasps> Chloe. It has a photo of Chloe. Let's go on his computer. Nathan is way into this party. Bad sign. Hey, gorgeous. Let me know that you're what you were wearing to the vortex this week, so I can wear something just as styling and expensive. Oh, bastard! Now I remember why I hate you, and why Kate will vortex get justice. Vortex Club October Potter Hard Gates Gone Wild. Oh man, Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Nay, hey, I know this has been a stressful week. No, 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 no. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. And far away. Brazil. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. This is strong stuff. Wow. <laughs> Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. I'd like to oppose her for reason application. Your name and record speaks for itself. Jesus, dude. Holy shit, that's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... 
Holy no, shit. No, 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 no. Yes, I got that. That's the gun Nathan used on Cl Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. I don't think this prescription has helped, Nathan. Is that champagne? Awesome. Scratch marks. What the hell are all those marks on the floor? Wanna move the couch a little? Yes. Let's find out what you're hiding. Oh yes, little phone. You are mine now. Awesome. Now I have Nathan's phone, so I can show it to Chloe. Well, before Nathan comes. Diploma. That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Adorable. Anything else we can snoop on? No? Well, let's leave. He's gonna notice someone broke into his room. Chloe, I got it. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. <laughs> Shit! What are you doing in my dorm? It's not your dorm, it's the boys' dorm. You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <laughs> ho. <clears throat> Warren. Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> Dude. <gasps> you are so fucking dead. Oh my god. Warren is Get so badass. Me, <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Oh god. Stop Warren. He could get in trouble. Oh fuck me. Warren, stop it. Come on. Oh, oh my head. Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you, you're all dead. Let's go. Now. Plus, my dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. Warren, I gotta talk Even to you. If Nathan definitely deserved a beating. We should try to be better than that. No, I actually just wanted to make sure Warren didn't get in trouble. Damn. That was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? For headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so He's so attractive better, right now. Um, Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. Why is he so attractive to me right now? Anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes. <laughs> you are. Man, He's that guy awesome. is so fucking in love with you. Yep. I know. He really did give a serious beat down to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. True. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! I 
Oh, there's the dead whales. They're kind of creepy, to be honest. God, I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole is going to help us find Rachel. You know what would be great? If I still had a gun. <laughs> yes, the chance for gunplay would just about even the odds here. Frank would scare better. He's a pussy. Besides, if I take him out, you can just rewind. Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. After Kate, I feel like every time I do, it might be the last. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? It's so weird just that in the another money, universe, and then we can get Chloe didn't even know Rachel. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Yoo-hoo, Frank. Frank, Yoo Frank doesn't need tinted windows when they're this dirty. Frankie, table, garbage. Nothing interesting here. Duck bowl. Frankie. <laughs> oh, look. The Wonder Twins. What up? You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. I'm Where's a shitty bodyguard if money? that's the case. Oh, I thank you. That wasn't so hard now, was it? And let's not do any more business again. Now, Actually, excuse me. No, we just need you to Frank. Could we ask you a couple quick questions? You have some serious lady balls. Yeah, we do. No. No, <laughs> dude. Jesus, okay. Okay. <laughs> but I'm not getting you high. Yeah, I, I don't... Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? It's Just about Rachel. Of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? We already checked your RV. You already did. Ah, oh, you fucking mental. I lost my keys, but I changed the lock. You better goddamn not be snooping around here. We no, already did. No, I'm not. I, I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell. Shit. You expect everything for free. We just gave you a shit ton of money. Handouts for me. I work for a living. You understand? Yes, Frank. Without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. Yeah, right. Okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank. We didn't come here to fight. This is so much bigger than us. Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. A day after, you pulled a fucking gun on me. I... I am so sorry about that. It might be the dumbest thing I've ever done. You're sure? And I've done a lot of dumb things this week. Finally, I believe you. But don't ever aim a gun at anybody unless you intend to kill. Although you don't look like you could kill a bug. I... I try not to, and I never would have pulled the trigger. I was just... Dude, she was scared, all right? You pulled your blade on me. We were all freaked out. Now we're all cool. Please? Okay, we're cool for now. But my dog isn't, 
And if you try any shit, he will bite your head off. He's done it before. Sure. Only here he to loves talk. us. Come on. I wouldn't mess with your dog. Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? Chloe and I gave your doggy a bone, wouldn't we? So you're the ones who let him out? You broke in here and let my dog out? What the fuck? Sorry. Wait. That's not what... Seriously, Frank, don't get all spun out. We're only here to find Rachel. Rachel isn't in here! And I'll spin you on your ass. What the fuck are you dorks up to, huh? Trying to break into my business? This time, the price is wrong, skank! Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Not ever tell me what to do. Yeah, I shouldn't have said that. Whoa! Get off of me! Motherfucker! <laughs> Listen, Chloe, I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Be careful, okay? Don't give Frank any excuses to go ballistic. We need his help, Chloe. Yep. You know, I'm not a total fuck-up. Occasionally I can be both cool and careful. Like now, okay? Yeah, be that. Just uh, that. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? You like dogs? Bumby doo Okay, other one of these. Uh, dog rescue. Of course I do. I heard you even rescued a bunch of fight dogs. That's amazing. No, all right, it was just the right thing to do. I couldn't stand to see those poor animals treated like, like slaves. Exactly. That's how I came to own Pompadou. That's very cool, Frank. Your dog is lucky you came along. Maybe we can focus on rescuing Rachel now? Rachel? Is that why you're really here? Yes, we're so close to finding her now, Frank. We need all the help we can get now, especially from you. You and Chloe do not know Rachel like I did, and I couldn't even help her. You're in way over your heads. Why don't you just go play in your clubhouse? Frank, you knew Rachel almost better than anybody. And you know more than us. Together, we could find her. Do you have anything to lose? When Rachel vanished, I pretty much lost everything. I can't stand not knowing where she is. Not hearing her voice or her laugh anymore. We can change all that. It's up to you. Help us find her, Frank. He was so Please. in love with her. We really need your client list. Well, if there's a chance in hell, you two dorks can find Rachel. I'll take it. My Thank dog is so barking at you, so I guess that's a good sign. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, we can have our gun get come back. Thank you. Thank you, Thank Frank. You. Yeah, thanks, Frank. Seriously. It's you're hard to take cool, your dude. characters seriously, but I want to. Good luck. Thank you. Doesn't it smell that horrible cool. in here? Frank gave up the code to help us. Rachel must have seen something good in him. Alrighty. Let's glow. Glow.
Chloe, are you okay? I'm glad things worked out okay with Frank. It's nice to have one less enemy in Arcadia Bay. Amen to that. And again, I'm going to end this episode here. I better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. I will see you. Oh, Frank. Thank you, Frank. And we'll see you in the next episode. Bye.